My name is Okira Farouf. I'm reporting live from Tafop Media International, Lagos, Nigeria. And I have a guest with me, Dixon Ali Bey. <laughs> welcome, welcome to the show. Thank you. I'm, very, I'm pleased. I'm happy that you guys are doing this. And uh, all the way from Canada, yes. America. Yes. It's nice. Thank you. All right. So, um, let us know you. Introduce yourself. Uh, my name is Dixon Alikbe. Okay. I'm in Nigeria, but I live in the U.S. Oh, nice. I've been there for about 23 years. Oh, wow. We have a show that's called Empire VIP House of Wheels. Okay. So that is what we're here for right now. You can see the vehicle you're in mm. there right now mm. is the tour bus we're using for the show. Okay. The, the show is about indoor and outdoor. So okay. we use the ROV bus where we are right now okay. to take our contestants for different assignments out there, mm. offices, different assignments we do. We use, we use our tour bus for their outing and okay. we have them inside for mm. the inside show. Oh, nice, nice, nice. Okay, um, can you tell us a little about your, um, your background, your history background on how you became a CEO? Uh, I love entertainment. Okay, nice. I've been, uh, uh, like I said, I've been, entertainment is some, I like having fun. Mm. You know, I, I kind of, me and my wife, my kids were like two different worlds. She's a pastor, she owns a church. Wow. <laughs> you know, uh, but she understands what, how, Mm. things work in the okay. way whereby we understand each other. Mm. I, uh, I love entertainment, I love God. Okay. You know? But um, generally, I think the, 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 the thing is that I truly love entertainment, so that's why I do what I do when it comes to entertainment. I'm working on shows, artists, I've done so many shows in America, here mm. in Nigeria. Okay. I have a company called Empire Entertainment, we do different shows, we go to red carpet, cover shows, okay. we cover January 4th, by different shows. Oh, nice, you nice. Know? And uh, we broadcast on uh, Silverbed every Saturday, okay. two to three. Oh, okay. And it's called Empire Hotspot. So okay. So entertainment is something I, I love. Entertainment. Nice, nice, nice. Awesome. Okay, so you're 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 based in the U.S., yes. but now you're in Nigeria. Yes. Why are you in Nigeria? Um, I'm in Nigeria because of the show. Okay. It's a current show called Empire VIP House on the Wheels. Mm. You know, we have 25 contestants. Okay. We, we are right in, in the house inside here, in the, mansion, the mansion, as we speak mm. right now, but we're inside our tour bus. Yes. So uh, I want the show to be as good as I can get. So, you know, I'm a hands-on CEO. Mm. I want things to be done. I don't leave any room on any room for any error, okay. you know, so mm. I just, uh, I believe that you being around, me being around would be a better way to coordinate it, and because it's the first edition, it's the first time we're doing it, so it's good to start well. Okay. Next time, then I can choose not to come if I want to, okay. if I don't want to. Okay. So I think the show is very important to me. I want the contestant to feel that value of bringing in, and I think you will tell you some of them. You yes. See, what they said about the show, mm. how wonderful the show is, mm. and how they don't want to go. <laughs> that quality is what we're looking for. Oh, nice, nice, nice. Okay, so what what would you say are are the challenges, rather challenges you faced during the course of of the show? Um, you know, we're in Africa. Yeah. Uh, I live in America, where almost you know you have guaranteed light, guaranteed security and all that, mm. but that does not mean not too well in our country, in our continent, you yes. know, yeah, they call us third world nation, but we're trying, you know, so, yes, there are challenges, a lot of challenges, but that must stop us to grow. We have to figure out which way is the right way for us to at least sell our product to the world, mm. you know, as a Nigerian and American, I believe both continent or both world need each other. Mm -hmm. You know, you have to sometimes they make they get that part of oh some people that doesn't travel wide. Yeah. They always believe that Africa is a different world, you know, 
mm-hmm. trees and all those stuff. Yeah. So it's good to give them food and pack of mm-hmm. us who we are. Yeah. That is a global village. The world is a global village right yeah. now. You know, you don't see people on the street. Just everybody, you know, people are doing well and yeah. it's tough that we're getting there. Mm-hmm. People are getting there. Oh, nice. Okay, so now back on Empire VIP House on Wheels reality TV show. What, what, where do you see the show in the next, say, five years? Um, Empire VIP House on Wheels is more... Reality shows are reality shows. Mm-hmm. You know, shows are shows. What yeah. makes us a little bit different, one, are tall balls. Secondly, the... We don't want the winners to win this money and they're still the same. Mm. We want them to use their money well. Okay. That's why our show is about business, okay. lifestyle, mm. uh, more of entertainment, you know. Uh, the way you carry yourself, mm. how you face the world, where you make this money. You know, most shows they give you this money, but before you know it, they don't really get yeah. the value. They don't understand what this money will do for them. And exactly. then they are carried away with the money or mm. people just rush them and mm. then they are back to square where they the came one, from. Yes. You understand? So it's better for us to at least educate them. You understand? It's about business, lifestyle, public relation, you know, everything to do with how you're going to face the world when mm. you make this money. You know, we're giving a like, car of about 10 million naira. Wow. The first person will get a car of 10 million naira, 5 million naira in cash. Get with the car? With the car. Nice. The second person will get 3 million naira, the third person will get 2 million naira. Okay, so why am I not contesting? I think you should ask yourself. You That's a lot! Next year, next year, yeah. next year. Next I'll be year. there! Please make sure you, you register. I'll be there! Wow, that's a lot. That's, Thank that's, you. that's Thank a lot. You. Nice, nice. Thank okay, so how's the show, how's the show been, generally? And generally, I think these are the the 17. The 17? Yes. Okay. So we, next week, Sunday is our grand finale. Oh, okay. The Greater Hotel. Okay. Uh, you, I mean, you've interviewed some of them. You mm. see how excited they are. Mm. So as far as I'm concerned, I'm not disappointed at all. Okay. Once the contestants are not disappointed, I'm not disappointed. Okay. Yes. Nice. It costs money to run this, but they are not disappointed. They are mm. happy. The experience is good. Most of them, they're telling you that even if they don't win, they are just happy to get the experience we give yeah, them. Yeah, they have something to take they back home. They have something to take back home, you mm. know. So that is my job. Okay. That is what makes me happy. Nice. Money is good, but money is not everything. Mm, you know, exactly. people go back home and say, oh, wow, I did something with my life. Yeah. Some of them, they tell you that they've never lived with people in a close setting like this before. Mm. They've never done this, but with this, they understand that, wow, it's good to live closer that you understand one mm. another, know how to tolerate one another, yeah. know how to live with one another. So their, their experience and their testimony mm. is my job. makes nice. me happy that we're nice. doing the right thing. Good stuff. Good stuff. Okay, so um, we'll talk about your shows outside Nigeria. Uh, tell us about them. Uh, outside Nigeria, in the US, I've done a lot of shows. Uh, Empire, Empire Africa. Mm. Empire Africa is in we register Empire Entertainment Smile in, in in America too. So we do it. We have our online podcast, we have a radio 360 here okay. in Nigeria, so we promote shows as well, we promote shows in Nigeria and, mm. and, and in America, okay. you know, we, like I said, I love entertainment, I love seeing people happy, mm. you know, I, I go to places, I just sit back, I just relax, and I just see people happy, when people are happy, then it, it just give me that, there's is beauty in this world, mm. uh, it's not about winning or sadness all the time. So I'm yeah. like, just relax. See your neighbor happy, mm. see your fellow human being happy. That gives me joy. You know, that is something I always enjoy doing or nice. seeing, you know, so nice. that's something I like. Okay. Okay, so what advice would you give to people that that want to organize uh, reality TV shows? My advice to people that want to organize reality TV shows, um, be ready, okay. plan, okay. be ready financially, be ready mentally, okay. be ready because um, if you're not ready, you're just making fool of the people who 
idea of reality show. Yeah. You know, there are some couple of scandals lately. You know, the organizer is not ready, mm. meeting with the contestant. Mm. You know, so many things that doesn't show that they'll be ready. Yeah. So it should not be a child's play. Mm. You know, if you want to do it, do it well. Okay. You understand? You see, when you don't do it well, it's like you're just making full of the whole idea. At a point, people like, people will now look at it and say it's just a joke. Mm. And they start seeing it as a scam. That is just, okay, they are here to scam. You mm. know, so I think, let them be ready. Okay. That is my advice. I'm not stopping anybody to do a reality show. Mm. You bring in a couple of people in the house for a month or two or whatever. Mm. Please remember, these are human beings. Of course. Be ready. Take care of them. You know, don't just see them as something people you just get Extort. money from, you mm -hmm. know, be ready to, as much as they want to vote, then mm -hmm. let them show that you have good intentions, you mean well for them, mm -hmm. you know, how could you do a show, you've not even bought a car you want to give to them, you've not, you're not ready at all, you know, that is the challenges I think that they're going through and I pray okay. they get, get it better. All right. Okay, thank you. Okay, thank you, thank you very much for coming, thank you for having us, it's been, it's been great. <laughs> been great wow well done well I'm done i'm happy that it's all the way from canada yes you know canada is a neighbor to where i live in minnesota okay so when i see my neighbor mm -hmm. something just triggered <laughs> my neighbors you know yeah me. so i'm happy thank you so much for this all right. thank you okay thank you um this is roots reporting from platform media international lagos nigeria bye to deliver urgently? Are there errands you need to run but time will permit you? Do you need those letters, reports, cards, ETC delivered today but it seems impossible? Mind your business and we will mind the rest of your business because helping you is our business. With same day delivery, we did not pick up and drop off. Bulk mail delivery, errand services and emergency delivery. Same day delivery, we deliver our packages in the most timely and efficient manner. Contact us today and we will be there. You need not to move an inch. Same day delivery will deliver in 24 hours. Same day, speed delivery.